As we have mentioned previously, Word from Microsoft is a powerful tool. Almost everyone will need it to write a letter, write down some notes from a meeting or class, or create a report. But you can use it not only as a simple word processor. Word can be a more complicated page layout program. Whenever you want to create something that involves text and pictures, you will find that Word can help you turn your ideas into a printed page faster and easier than ever. Here we will present three cases that you can use Word to complete. The first one, use Word to make your document in a more professional style. Second, we will show you how to create a poster using Word program. And in the last case, we will show you how to create a brochure. Create a document in a professional style. You will find that Microsoft Word contains dozens of useful features that will help you to create a document in a more professional style. So get your document ready and let's see the video. To make your document in a more professional style, please follow the following steps. First, please open your document. You can use preset style to instantly format your work. Here, you can also create your own style for your document. Now, click and drag over the text to select it, and then use the quick style gallery to select style for your text. For each paragraph, you can select the context and then click the dialog box launch display item on the paragraph. You can set up this paragraph by, for example, change spacing and set it as before half lines or modify the line space spacing as double, then click OK. Please select the first paragraph. On the insert tape, you can see drop cap and click dropped. Move the cursor next to the text that you want to add a comment. Click Reference under the Insert Footnote.
in the button of the article page you can add your notes on a reference tab you can also click the picture and then you can insert captions In the document text followed following the word of the red box line, right click in the word behind. The word will identify possible word to be corrected. To add page numbers, on the insert tape, select the header and footer groups. Click the down arrow to the right of the page number icon. And then you can select the location of the page number on the page number menu. You can choose to place the number in various location at the page. In the footer editing space, you can click date and times and then insert the date. After you have finished your editing, you can select Close Header and Footer. You can add a border by clicking the Page Layout tapes on a ribbon. In the Page Background group, click Page Border. Words include several cover pages, pages you can use in your document. Click the cover page and on a label you can modify this label's content. If you want to change the picture you used in the document, click the picture. On the format tape and click the change picture. Congratulations, you have finished it. Now you can pre preview your document in the window. Creating a poster. 
When you have any message to tell others, post a poster on the site can be a great idea. A nice looking poster can help you to touch others' attention. So get your idea ready and let's see the video. To create a poster, please follow the following step. When you want to create a poster, you can have two choices, portrait or landscapes. Portrait, which is the default setting, is longer than it is wide. The landscape setting is wider than it is longer. In the document, on the page layout tapes in the page setup groups, click orientation. Select landscapes. Word displays the page in landscape layout. On the insert tape, click shapes in the illustrations groups on the ribbon. In the basic shape groups, click the, sh the shape that you want. The cursor changes to a cross. Draw your picture and adjust picture's direction. On the format tape, in the shape styles groups, you can change its color. Click the text box and then select the draw text box to new a text box. Click the insert tape. In the text groups, click the word art icon and make a poster title. You can add additional text in your poster if you want. Click Clip Art and in the search for box, you can search graph and insert for your poster. Click page color and join the poster background. Click the page layout tapes on a ribbon. 
In the page background groups, click Page Border. Open borders and shading. You can choose a pattern to make the frame for your poster. Now, congratulations, you have finished it. Now you can preview your poster in the window. Creating a brochure. A brochure is an advertising piece mainly used to introduce a company or organization and inform about products and or services to a target audience. Brochures are usually distributed by mail, emails, or handed personally. A nice looking brochure is a great starting point of your relationship. So let's see the video. To create a brochure, please follow the following steps. To create a brochure, the first thing is to set a proper size for it. On the page layout tapes, select size. The size menu offers various page size choices for your brochure. On the insert tape, you can click on picture to insert picture. With the picture selected, click text wrapping. You can crop a picture, screenshot, or clip art to reduce its size or change the focus of the image. Click Insert to add a text box. Select Word Art to produce the title. Open the Edit World Art window. Edit the text. The title can be adjusted to the required size. Select through to put the text box in front of the picture you just Edit.
You can modify the bullet symbol used in your text by click the bullet. Select define new bullet and then you can use a new symbol for your text. On the page layout, you can select borders and shadings from the borders menu to display the borders and shading dialog box. On the box, you can click to add a new frame and modify the border as you want it. After, after it is completed, click OK. Congratulations, you have finished it. Now you can preview your brochure in the window.